I'm Dominic here, Jamaica Cottage Shop, and we're here with Joel Sager. And I'm Janet Sager. And these guys here have just put together this Vermont cottage here in Cavendish, Vermont. It is set up with solar. I appreciate you guys showing us this today. It's a lot of fun. No problem. And as our <laughs> son says, how do we spell fun? W-O-R-K. <laughs> You chose the 16 by 20 Vermont Cottage Option A. So yeah, yes. uh, the inside is 12 by 20. Uh, it does come standard with the loft here. And then you have the solar right here, right? Right, yes. uh, the controller. Yeah. Is this is the inverter and the controller? Yeah. And the batteries are inverter, in the box there. Charge controller. This is a switch so I can, uh, when I start my generator, I have it off. Once it's up and running, I can flip it on and it comes in. Now these lights are in the fan is uh, running on the, yeah, solar. On, the, on the solar. Yep. Yeah, you got the kitchen set here. I see the, the refrigerator. Yeah, that's electric. And you're uh, using the oven? It's a little propane. Yeah, it's a camp stove, but it does have a little oven. And the oven's running on propane, propane as well. Yeah. Yep, yep. And uh, you got the coffee maker. Only, only when it's a bright sunny day, or I'm not allowed to use it. <laughs> <laughs> We're using the so nature's head, compost yeah. your toilet. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. I have to show you the. Yeah, I'm sure light on in here because I have to show. We have to show you one of our favorite okay. things. It's behind you. This is our kettle. I have a sip kettle out here. Yep. You've got one of the Zohos, huh? Yep. You put the water in the, on the shelf in the soup kettle, whatever temperature you like. You have a little uh, button. You reach through, hit the button. It comes out. The water comes out, and it drains into the oil. And let's use, see where you're heating the water. Well, <laughs> on the stove. If it's winter, you put it on the stove. If it's if you need it last night, it was so hot yesterday, the water was warm without anything. But you can heat it on the stove if you want. But there's the kettle. And you can see the, the camp stove. So we are oh, yeah. super proud of our little shower. We love it. You're uh, collecting the rainwater? Oh, yeah. We collect the rainwater and use it for gardens. Because we, oh. we don't have running water. Well, we have a well. We just had the well put in this summer, but the well is way over there and the gardens are over here. Yeah. So we, we put it into here and then I can water the, the gardens. So Joel, this is the, the well here. This is the pump house. The pump house. Yes. So this is a little bit bigger, this it looks. This is a bigger one. Well, when you're pumping water 380 feet, you need a little bigger. Yeah, that's a deep well. Yeah, pretty deep. But it works great. Now. See, this isn't a, a traditional well. You got something on the cap there. Okay, this is the, well, this is the electrical coming off of it, and this is attached to the hose. So when we want water, um, we turn it on. There's a, you have to plug it in, and then it's got, uh, what is that, a third? Uh, it's only 20, uh, two pull 20 for the well. Now, where is the uh, second generator? There's one in there. See, this comes off the back. And that ties that plugs in. plugs into this. And that's just a common generator. You can get those at any of the home stores. Yes. Yeah. This one's a lot smaller. The other one is 7,000 watts. 240 volt. And you've got it well ventilated there. Oh yeah. The whole top is open and the door is always open. Now this one's running on gasoline. This is just gasoline. But the other one is dual fuel. Yeah. Before we bought the property, uh, we found your website. 
And I remember, this would have been late 90s, I remember um, jotting it down and printing it, and I had it in a file, my file of maybe someday. And, and that would have been late 90s, and then it would have been a good 15 years later that, that uh, we ended up getting this.